Hello, my name is Rebecca from PTC, and today I'm going to be showing you a few, but not all, of the different ways you can create a basic 3D plot in MathCAD. Let's begin! Here you can see we have a 4x4 matrix representing the elevation of land. To add a 3D plot, you go to the Plots tab, Insert Plot, 3D Plot. We have defined the matrix as elevation, and if we insert this into the plot, you can see we get the results. We can select a surface fill as well as a line, thickness, and color. In this case, the values in the matrix are representing the heights of the points at the coordinates. The coordinates are represented by the value of the column or row within the matrix. In the next example, we have a matrix containing three columns. In this case, the first column represents x, the second y, and the third z. It will plot each coordinate as a point. Again, you can change the color and thickness if you'd like. If you choose, you can connect the points with a line as well. Anything other than three columns will plot the x and y coordinates as the index of the array in the matrix. For the last example, we have two functions. When you plot two data sets, you need to add trace, which is located near insert plot at the top. This will allow you to get a placeholder for the additional function. Unlike plotting in 2D, when you plot a function in 3D, we don't include the arguments to the function inside the plot. You can adjust the surface fill of each data set independently. This will help differentiate between the two. You can also zoom by clicking the magnifying glass or by scrolling with your mouse. You can snap the plot back to the original view by clicking here. Finally, if you want to change the axis, you click the axis and can adjust them on this bar. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe and look out for more videos.